Well, hey, welcome back. This is Dave DeBow, and today I'm starting a series of videos on what I call your top 10 reasons that you, as an everyday real estate investor, should consider being interviewed on a podcast. And today we're going to be talking about reason number one, and that is to really kind of share your story and inspire other people. So as a real estate investor, when you're interviewed on a podcast, it gives you a great opportunity to share your experiences as an active real estate investor. And that way you can share your strategies, your challenges, your breakthroughs with other people who are kind of either at the same level or maybe a step or two behind you and really go out there and inspire other folks. So one of the things you can do when you're interviewed on a podcast is you can talk about what it is that you do as a real estate investor. There are so many different ways to invest in real estate. We've got people that are doing multifamily, single family, flips, wholesaling, buy and hold, short-term rentals, self-storage facilities, commercial, you name it. There are literally dozens and dozens and dozens of different real estate investing strategies. So what you can do is you can illustrate what you're up to and kind of compare and contrast that to what some other people in your area might be doing as well. And it's really kind of fun to do this because everybody brings their own kind of unique twist to things. Everybody brings their own little secret sauce, something that they're doing differently or better than most other people. And when you share that on a podcast, it really goes a long way to inspire and educate other people. The other great thing about being interviewed on a podcast is it really helps other folks and yourself as well when you share not just your wins, but your challenges. I don't know about you, but a lot of my best learning experiences have come not from the successes I've had, but the times that I've kind of fallen down. And one of the, the major ways that I've gotten satisfaction in my professional career is by helping other people to avoid making the dumb mistakes or the accidental mistakes that I've made in myself in the past. And you can do the same thing. If you are on a podcast and you're open to sharing not just your wins, but some of the challenges that you face as well, it is a great way to not just inspire and educate, but to help other people avoid some of the challenges you faced in the past. The other great thing about sharing your story on a podcast is that it really offers you the opportunity to inspire other people who are just like you, who maybe haven't taken the leap into real estate investing. So I know, I've been podcasting for years now and I've interviewed all sorts of folks from all sorts of backgrounds. But what I find, for example, is when women come on the show, women real estate investors, one of the things they really want to do is they want to inspire other women to get involved in real estate investing. When I interview uh, newcomers to the country, new, newer immigrants to the country, part of their why for being on a podcast is to inspire other people just like them who are perhaps recent new arrivals to the country who are scared about getting into real estate investing. They want to show them that, hey, guess what? If I can do this, you can do it as well. So that's another great reason for being interviewed on a podcast. All right, so speaking about being interviewed on a podcast, if this piques your curiosity, if you're interested in this at all, then I've got something very, very, very special for you. I've been running my podcast, the Property Profits Real Estate Podcast, since 2018. And at the time that we're doing this recording, I'm at over 460 episodes into the show. And these days what I'm doing is I am interviewing what I call everyday people investing in real estate. And I'd like to interview you. If you've got at least one deal done under your belt, then jump on an interview with myself and let's talk about it. Let's take a look at your journey and let's see how you can inspire other people to take action as well. And to do that, just click on the link that's in the description below, or you can go to daveinterviewsyou.com. Take care. See you on the next episode.